Welcome back to a new tutorial with Aquacomputer Berlin DE and ModMyMachine.com. Today I'm going to show you how to mount a G200 cooler for NVIDIA graphic cards, a water cooler of Aquacomputer um, on a GTX 260. It's the same on GTX 260 and GTX 280. So we'll start in a second. You need thermal grease, a graphic card, screwdrivers, scissors, the aqua graphics and the screws and the thermal pad we supply. First of all we disassemble the whole graphic card cooler. So pull off the sticker. Be careful by taking off the ground. There are some little noses all around. Be careful by lifting or a little bit. Remove all thermal pads anywhere on the card. Afterwards, clean the GPU. Next you apply thermal grease on the PCI bridge connector, on the RAM and on the GPU. On the GTX 260, you get one, two, three, four, five MOSFETs. Take the tunnel pad, cut it into five pieces that fit on the MOSFETs, and mount it. On the GTX 280, you have seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They are missing on the GTX 260. Always keep that in mind if you mount it on a GTX 280. There are two more MOSFETs. Now you can mount the cooler. Um, a good point for orientation is uh, the GPU bracket. Just place it there and everything should be fine. First of all, mount four original screws around the GPU. After that, also tighten seven screws that are left. So this was a tutorial of Aqua Computer Berlin DE and ModMyMachine.com how to mount the Aqua Graphics G200 cooler on an NVIDIA graphic card GTX 260 or GTX 280. Stay tuned for the next tutorial and keep on modding. <laughs>